Hello and welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Enemy Unknown. So, when we last left off, we were going to finally get that goddamn access lift built. So, we'll go back access to the activity. There we go. Okay, now can we? No, we can't. We have to excavate first. That's a little bit cheating. Hmm. Okay, so we want either the thermo generator or the Illyrium one, but if we want the Illyrium one we need to get another power source and we missed out on that with our last um, UFO which was a bit irritating um, hmm. now what, ooh, no don't want to do that yes I want to cancel the project uh, now whether to build a foundry or not I think research speed won't be so important right now, because we've got a fair few scientists. We've got 16, and we've got one laboratory, and we can always come back to it later. So I think what I'll do is I'll begin construction of the foundry. Hmm. We can excavate there. change my mind. Yes, I'm a bit like that. Instead, we'll build a power generator there. And excavate nothing at the moment. We'll wait a little bit for the foundry. We still have 305 credits. And I believe we've got nobody out at the moment except Robinson. Cool. So we might even hire another couple of soldiers. Done. Mission control. Scanning, scanning. Satellite coverage now available over Russia. Excellent. And alien nav computer has been finished. Cool. So, we've had the opportunity to study these devices in a limited fashion. As we discovered, they do contain some form of encrypted alien data. However, they're also completely reliant on an internal power supply, which when depleted renders the device inaccessible. The only means we've found to gather the information from this equipment is by routing its internal power system through a crudely assembled interface that bypasses any built-in shutdown sequences. However, the alien data itself presented an even greater obstacle, as we're dealing with a programming language that is unlike anything found in our own systems. Fortunately, the research team is quite capable, and we've quickly assembled a small group of our best analysts for the task. We've already begun to establish patterns in the alien encryption algorithm, revealing small bits of information that can be integrated into our own research. And we've been able to unlock the satellite nexus. Cool, so it's basically an upgraded version of the uplink. Because it can handle four satellites instead. Okay. Ooh, new fighter craft. But that'll take a fair while. And cost lots of weapon fragments. Versus outside a shard, skeleton suits, illyrium, precision lasers. Heavy lasers, the light plasma rifle. Hmm. I think we'll go for heavy lasers next. Sounds like a good idea. Might be able to get something superior to the Phoenix cannon. And facilities. Satellite Nexus requires lots of money, 25 engineers, and 8 power. But except for the money, we've actually got everything, and the workshop will be finished in 8 days. That's actually not bad. How much power does it require? It requires 8 power. So we've currently got 3 available power generator itself will create another six plus two for being adjacent to an existing one cool 
so we'll be able to build one soon enough. Excellent, that's not bad at all. And we might have to hope we get a mission where we can retrieve some stuff to sell. And in two days, new soldiers will arrive at XCOM HQ. Nice, not bad at all. Mission control again then. Raven 1 is back online. We'll just go to the hangar and equip Raven 1 with a Phoenix cannon. Yes. Nice. Okay, so we are now able to build essentially anything that we have the equipment for. So we need the extra five engineers, which we'll get in five days. Nice, not bad at all. So hopefully we get a mission where we can uh, acquire some money. Ooh, abductions! Commander, we're receiving several urgent requests for assistance. There are abductions in progress at each marked site on the Hologlobe. Okay, so we've got Edmonton in Canada, with a panic rating of 1. Oh, we sort of have to do Egypt. Even though it'll net us scientists instead of... Um, what we really want. Hmm. Very difficult. Actually, let's have a look at the regular map in the Situation Room. Asia's pretty good. But panic will be driven up in China. And in the... North America's. Hmm. I think we have to take the African one. Difficult. Very difficult. We don't get any engineers either way, so... Scientists, I guess, are basically our best shot. Okay, and we don't want trips with us. Instead, we want Spectre. Okay, so we've got Cardones, Wood, Cooper, the Ghetto. Um, we might as well take the Arc Thrower with us. We don't want you in command, though. We want Cardones in command. And... What was it? Wood. Yes. Okay, so he's got a nanofiber vest. Scope, scope. Um... Hmm. It says it's going to be very difficult. So I think we might want Haddad for this one. Yep, we can take Haddad. So we're just going to find uh, Cooper. Edit him. Give back your awesome gear. Give it back, I said. Uh -huh. Oops. And we'll give Cardone as the uh, scope. Because he does alright. He's got 12 health already. He could do with the aim boost. Oops. So, Haddad. Carapus armor. And if I first. Have we got another rifle? No. Hmm. Nah, we'll keep the. Like, keep uh, the ghetto with that. Okay, I think we're ready. On our way to Egypt. Actually, it's fitting that Haddad comes with us then. Strike Since we're going to our home country. Land. We're dropping you just inside the Egyptian border. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Alrighty. It says it's very difficult, so I'm assuming that we're going to encounter at least one chrysalid. Which could be very bad. But, hopefully, with the uh, team we've got, we should be okay. We 
We've got a good team. Everyone's got game faces on. Okay, so let's have a look at the map. Strike one is cleared to engage hostile targets. Watch your backs out there, people. Well, our left flank's covered, so that's always good. Uh, we'll put wood. Over there. And Haddad. Over here. Go, go, go. Still don't see anything. That's always good. Uh, I'll put Solyov over there. Fungi can go help Haddad. Jackson, can he go up? I hope so. Well, we'll send him over with um, wood. Let's see if we can get him to go up stairs and we'll put Rafe over here. Let's see how we go. Anything? We hear a lot of alien activity, but we don't see anything at present. Jackson, can you go upstairs? No, you can't. Okay. In that case, let's swap over to your pistol. There's not a lot of cover. That's problematic. Open fire. Ooh. We see enemies. Lots of enemies. Okay, but Cardones is in position to take advantage of that. Legetho. If you get there, you've got cover. Always good. Haddad. What can you do? You can't really do anything. Um, might wait with her move then. Solyov. Can't really do much. Madman would. We'll have him running gun so he can get into position. So we want him up here. Nice. Uh, we'll keep Solyev. Where's a good spot for him? There really isn't one. We'll keep him where he is. Put him on Overwatch just in case something comes out of that door. And Jackson can head over here. Going to Overwatch with his pistol. Okay, Cardones, what have you got? 61, 61, 41. Okay, we'll take 61 then. Nice. Good takedown, good takedown. Wood, what have you got? 59. Hmm. Or you could flush him out of cover, but that might push him away from where he is. We'll leave that for now. We might just want wood on Overwatch. Uh, Legetho, what have you got? A 25% chance. Take it. Okay, not too good. Negative damage. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. Uh, we'll have Hadad use her run and gun as Going well. Yeah, use your run and gun move. Get over there. And what have we got? 68. 42. 68. Goes down to 53. But double shot. No, we'll take 68. Do it. Damn. Ah, damn it. Quite so. Eloquently put. Yeah, give it a go. Oh dear. You just set the car on fire, didn't you? No. That's interesting. Okay, that guy went into Overwatch. What's he gonna do? Maybe he'll drop in behind us. Ah, but he can't do anything from there. Watch the moving right. Okay, 
don't want you to shoot that guy. Shoot at this guy instead. Oh, that's a really, really bad shot. Okay, new plan. Swap back to your rifle. What have you got on him? Headshots. No. Nah. Use your headshot on that guy. Come on, make it count. Yes. Well played, well played, sir. Soliev doesn't have a good shot, but if Wood moves up here. Uh oh. Oh yeah, lightning reflexes. Good. Well done, sir. Lightning reflexes saves the day. Okay, so he's drawn the fire. He hasn't got a fantastic shot. Better than nothing. Set the car on fire, at least. If that guy doesn't move, he's toast. Uh, Solyov, though. If we move him here... He has a shot now, and he can do suppression, so Suppressing give me cover and fire. Nice. Okay, and the Geth, so... Move up here. Might as well do it. Target's available. Okay, overwatch for you then, sir. Our then is move up here. Nothing for you either. Okay, watch trips. trips. No, watch. More effective. Yeah, let's see what happens. Ooh! Came in behind us. Cheeky bastards. This is not going to end well. may want to instruct your men to exercise restraint when using explosives. While certainly effective at killing aliens, they also destroy the artifacts we're hoping to recover from the bodies. Just something to consider. Not my fault, Doc. They stood behind the stupid car. Okay, he hasn't got a great shot. Well, you can move up here, so that's always good. And you've got a yellow. Doubly excellent. Okay, take him down. Nice. Ammo out. That's okay. Wood head over there. What have you got for me? 39 and a 39. Uh, take that one. Hell yes. Okay, Haddad's got nothing. Alrighty, Mr. Wood. Uh, not Mr. Wood, Mr. Jackson. Make me proud. Really? Shot failed to connect. I am disappointed. Just putting it out there, son. I am disappointed. Okay, he's got a 52% chance. Give me suppression fire. Uh-oh. <laughs> that's going to end very badly. Cardonez is now standing next to a car that's going to explode, and so are you. Okay, well, uh... What if... He's there. Overwatch. Dad moves here. And goes to Overwatch. See how things go. He's not gonna move. That's actually not bad, but the car's gonna explode in a second. Yeah, there it goes. Okay, Cardonis is going.
going to be out for the fight again. Because he stood too bloody close to a car that was going to explode. But that's alright, because Soliev can patch him up. Fix hey, him. Quiet, you big baby, you're fine. Negative ammo, I'm spent. Yeah, yeah, I know, it's cool. And you need to reload. You need to reload as well. Yes. Back and roll. You can go into Overwatch. The Gatho can move up there and go into Overwatch. And Jackson can swap to his pistol and move there to Overwatch. And hopefully we don't die horribly. Okay, so alien activity was alright. Um, you need to reload. Back yes. In. I guess so. You need to move here. See nothing. Mr. Wood, move there, please. Oh, more floaters. It seems there's only floaters. Which is strange. Why so many? Alrighty, well in that case I want him to run and gun. Move here. And go into overwatch mode. Trips, move there. Overwatch, please. Overwatch for him as well. Is there an extra level in that building? I'm just somehow not seeing. I don't know. That's confusing. Okay, well, in that case, uh, I might move Jackson there. And put him onto Overwatch with the pistol. Cardones to here. And overwatch with the big gun. Alrighty. Okay, so that one went into overwatch too. And the rest of them did nothing. That's strange. Okay, well, Solyov can move up there then. What have we got? 61%? Do it. <laughs> Keeping score. Nice done. Wood has nothing. But he can move over to here. Good job, sir. And open that door. Oops. What have you got? 80%. Take it. You missed. Yeah, missed the target. I'm very disappointed. Okay. But she has run and gun. Moving to fire position. So she can move to here. Through the window. Got two bogeys. Where's the other one? Oh. Okay. We'll take that guy out. Not bad, not bad. Olyov can't do anything from there, so you should just go into Overwatch. The Getho. What have you got for me? 45%? Might as well. Nice. Negative damage. You didn't do anything, but you managed to blow a hole into the uh, building. Successful effort, I say. Uh, Jackson. No, he sees nothing. Okay, Overwatch it is. Let's see what happens. Ooh. Not bad. Not bad at all. Watch the flanks, they're moving! She's gonna get hurt bad. That's okay, she's still alive. Oh, maybe not. They're flanking my 
position. Yeah, she's dead. Wow. Okay, she's not dead, but she's definitely out of it for a while. Uh, first things first, then. Yeah, she's going to be out of that for ages. I want you to get some revenge. Give me Dacker on the target. Nice. He's down. Good job. Give me some love. What is that? That's not love. It's not even close to love, dude. Take him down. One. Son, I am disappointed. Do it. Nice. Another one down. Good work, Commander. Cool. So Operation Frozen Breath is complete. We lost nobody. We almost lost a dad. That would have been sad. But we did okay. Panic in Egypt has been lowered, so hopefully South Africa is happier. Well, Africa as a whole. Oh, nice! Woods a captain. Uh, we'll give him close combat specialist, I think. Seeing as uh, we've given him skills that are good for getting him up close. We'll give him close combat. Nice. Ah, the ghetto is an assault as well. Not bad. And Jackson's been promoted to a lieutenant. So you can take Disabling Shots or Battle Scanner. Battle Scanner, I think. Nice. Okay, so Rafe's out of it for six days and Trips is out of it for 14. But we've got 10 floater corpses and some weapon fragments. We Not bad. Will be in touch, Commander. 